clean the denture really good before you apply your cushion grip. You want it to be completely dry. My cushion grip has been soaking for the past five minutes. Take the cap off, put your little thingy on there, your little gripper. This is what it looks like. I definitely got too much. It's a thermoplastic adhesive and you are gonna roll it in your hands to warm it up, okay? So I also like to do this with mine because I want it to be really pliable and easy to work with. And then I'm going to make a little Play-Doh snake. So yeah, I like that. You are going to place that just right in the ridge of your denture. I'm pressing the cushion grip down in there. So it's all right if there's like some extra, like it seems like it's too much, like that's okay. Because when you put them in, it's all gonna flow over and you can trim it. So let this sit for about five minutes and then you're gonna put it in your mouth. Five minutes later. I'm gonna go ahead and put these babies in. Make sure your gums are wet when you put this in. I just like to bite and I'll leave it like that for a few minutes and let it get the impression of my gums and everything. I would leave them in for about two hours. Two hours, don't eat, um, kind of like let everything set and get that perfect mold of your gums, you know what I mean? Cushion grip is a game changer, especially if you are having trouble with your the fit of your dentures. Life-changing stuff right here, you guys.